my lunch nasi goreng is ready is so beautifully pre prepared and presented by my housekeeper because she prepared it for the guest this morning since the guest is Indonesian so it was served for breakfast with papaya it's 2 30 in the afternoon on Thursday I was supposed to post of course another video yesterday again it is delayed this time second time that it's delayed so uh, I'm posting it today which is Thursday my apology so I just like to share with you here since I'm sitting on my balcony and again fanning and it's 2 30 in the afternoon so anytime for me it's hot anyway because I haven't acclimatized believe it or not so this is one of the fruits that we have in Indonesia it is called mangosteen in English but it is called mangis in Indonesian so it's very easy to open I'd like to share this with you here it is okay you can press like this like this you can press like that or I'm just afraid that it, the juice will drop on my laptop so I'm going to put it further behind so you see it cracks there it cracks then you just open it you just open it you can also cut halfway like that if you want it to be neater but here in Asia we just break it open and here it is there how do you eat it we Indonesian we just eat like that we open again some more open again some more and then we just eat it like that but to make it more civilized we will, we will take a fork and eat it like that if you see anything yellow stain on it don't eat it because that's um, bitter and it has soft pits inside I, I uh, inadvertently swallowed last night one which never happened before but I swallowed one yet last night mm. if you haven't tasted this Please make it a point to taste it. It's so delicious. So that was a stone. And this is another one. Oh, it's so delicious. Juicy, sweet, soft, meaty. My favorite, most favorite fruits in the world is this and mango. Last night, my housekeeper put one big bowl in my bedroom and around 2.30, 4 o'clock in the morning, I ate the whole bowl and I only have two left. Uh, I could eat non-stop. And then the last one, this one. Mm. Mm. So sweet. Out of this world. Mango and mangoes for me, or mangosteen for me. The best in the world, the best. And then comes the western fruits in Italy I like kaki love kaki and uh, what else yeah the best fruits for me mango 
mangis and khaki also it's okay so that's it so how are you it's Thursday of course like I mentioned already before and I'm sitting here on my balcony just like yesterday with the guest of my bed and breakfast and my neighbor so we had a lovely coffee and some Manadonese cakes. Manadonese is from Manado. Manado is from North Celebes and Celebes or Sulawesi is one of the islands of the Indonesian archipelago and originally my parents are from Manado, my father. And But I have never been there so it is called Manado and uh, the cakes yesterday were manadonese the food is known to be very very spicy and hot and yet it's very breezy but i'm still not acclimatized in jakarta so that's it and um, what shall i share with you because oh yeah the difference of what i like and what i miss of italy okay i what I love in Indonesia, that's why I cannot compare the two. It's like uh, comparing oranges and apples. And uh, I love both countries. So, uh, you know, wherever I am, you know, for me to live in, I am fine. The only thing what I miss about Italy is the four climates, uh, four seasons, and the ability to walk in the street and the ability to watch people. And the lifestyle and the vicinity to other Europe con European countries that are near Milan. Here, I love the rhythm of the life because it's very slow. It's very relaxing. And of course, you know, I love my house and uh, I have all the helps I need. But still, it doesn't mean that I'm all... perfect now no because there's no perfection I just need to be taking care of this bed and breakfast business of mine that I would like to thrive with it and that's it that's what I'm doing and um, yeah I am happy you know every morning to wake up in this atmosphere once in a while I miss somebody to eat with because like today I had lunch but I didn't have appetite much because I miss somebody to eat with you know to have a good company to eat with but somebody who knows how to eat also but I don't I prefer to eat by myself rather than having someone to eat with who doesn't appreciate food then I might as well eat by myself or on my own but uh, yes i need company once in a while to eat with you know so today i didn't have uh, much lunch uh i think i will uh, i think it will, it will be shown by now the fried rice that was uh, prepared by my housekeeper which was uh, served for my bed and breakfast guest this morning so that's it i think this is the vlog for thursday I don't want to bore you again with my long rambling talk and for now I wish you a lovely Thursday and Friday and then weekend and Sunday I will come up with another 